Good morning, and welcome to our journey with the Psalms, journey through the Psalms with St. Albans Episcopal Church. I'm the Reverend William Stanton on this Saturday morning. It's a beautiful day this morning. The birds are chirping and it's very quiet out, which is why I'm being a little bit more softer in my tone. Our journey this morning is beginning on the 13th day of June. So our 13th day of the Psalms of morning prayer, starting on page 676 uh, with Psalm 68. And we'll be reading three Psalms, oh, just two, just one Psalm today. Psalm 68, it's a longer Psalm, six, 36 verses. So, Let's begin. Let God arise and let his enemies be scattered. Let those who hate him flee before him. Let them vanish like smoke when the wind drives them away. As the wax melts into the fire, so let the wicked perish at the presence of God. But let the righteous be glad and rejoice before God. Let them also be merry and joyful. Sing to God. Sing praises to his name. Exalt him who rides upon the heavens. Yahweh is his name. Rejoice before him. Father of orphans and defender of widows, God is in his holy habitation. God gives the solitary a home and brings forth prisoners into freedom. But the rebels shall live in dry places. O oh God, when you went before, when you went forth before your people, you, when you marched through the wilderness, the earth shook and the skies poured down rain at the presence of God, the God of Sinai, at the presence of God, the God of Israel. You sent a gracious rain, O oh God, upon your inheritance. You refreshed the land when it was weary. Your people found their home in it. In your goodness, O oh God, you have made provisions for the poor. The Lord gave the word. Great was the company of women who bore the tidings. Kings with their armies are fleeing away. The women at home are dividing the spoils. Though you lingered among the sheepfolds, you shall be like a dove whose wings are covered with silver, whose feathers are like green gold. When the Almighty scattered kings, it was like the snow falling in Zalman. Almighty mountain, O oh, hill of Bashan, O oh, rugged mountain, O oh, hill of Bashan. Why do you look with envy, O oh, rugged mountain, at the hill which God chose for his resting place? Truly, the Lord will dwell there. The chariots of God are 20,000, even thousands of thousands. The Lord comes in holiness from Sinai. You have gone up on high and led the captive, captive, kept and you have gone up on high and led captivity captive. You have received gifts even from your enemies, that the Lord God might dwell among them. Blessed be the Lord day by day, the God of our salvation who bears our burdens. He is our God, the God of our salvation. God is the Lord by whom we escape death. God shall crush the heads of its enemies and the hairy scalp of those who go on still in their wickedness. The Lord has said, I will bring them back from Bashan. I will bring them back from the depths of the sea. That your foot may be dipped in blood, the tongues of your dogs and the blood of your enemies. See your procession, O God, your procession into the sanctuary, my God and my King. The singers go before Musicians follow after, in the midst of maidens playing upon the hand drums. Bless God in the congregation. Bless the Lord, you that are the fountain of Israel. There is Benjamin, the least of the tribes at the head, the princes of Judah in the company, and the princes of Zebulon and Naphtali. Send forth your strength, O God. Establish, O God, what you have wrought for us. Kings shall bring gifts to you. For your temple's sake at Jerusalem. Rebuke the wild beasts of the reeds, 
and the peoples a herd of wild bulls with its calves. Trample down those who lust after silver. Scatter the peoples that delight in war. Let tribute be brought out of Egypt. Let Ethiopia stretch out her hands to God. Sing to God, O kingdoms of the earth. Sing praises to the Lord. He rides in the heavens, the ancient heavens. He sends forth his voice, his mighty voice. Ascribe to God his majesty over Israel. His strength is in the skies. How wonderful is God in his holy places, the God of Israel, giving strength and power to his people. Blessed be God. Beloved, that is our psalm for this morning. And I just will take with me today. Blessed be the Lord day by day, the God of our salvation, who bears our burdens. Place your burdens at the feet of God, at the feet of Christ. Let God bear your burdens this day, whatever those burdens may be. And if you are able, get out into the sunshine. Wear your mask. We wear our masks for love of others, not for ourselves. And beloved, I hope you have a blessed day this day. I'll see you tonight around 5.30 or so as we continue with our 13th day evening prayer psalms, beginning with Psalm 69. We'll do 69 and 70. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.